professor from Minister said to me, this lady is intellectually <laughs> arrogant. Right? <laughs> and that's what And I want to, to talk about that as we round off that conversation. I'm shocked that you listen to that. only detractors. I like, listen to everybody. You, you haven't <laughs> heard anyone who says good things about me. <laughs> and you expect me to come out, out of here Let's take feeling good about myself. I mean, JJ, do you know how many people said I shouldn't come to you because yeah. you are a journalistic buffoon? <laughs> It's okay. And it's I okay. didn't tell you, but we I get that all the time. No, okay, no, let's no, take no, a break, no, no, Prof. No, no. Let's take a break. No, 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 but, but I want to call you to order here. Yeah. You you cannot do that because yeah. you know that if you're a change maker, there will be people who call you names. Yeah. I am not going to allow you to do that to me. It's the yeah. second time that you're mentioning the yeah. detractors. Do you know? How many people have written long tributes? Okay. And do you know how many people said Prof, I must talk to Anika Larson let's take before a, I talk to you because let's, you let's are take a, a joke. Break. Yeah, let's take a break. Let's take a no, break. No, no, no. I want you to know yeah. that they said to me, you have no credibility. Yeah. You are a joke. It's fine. And we I hear that all the time. You. Let's take a break, bro. Yeah, yeah. But all I'm saying yeah. to you is you hear that all the time. I yeah. do not want your voice telling the world yeah. that I'm intellectually arrogant. JJ, I need my reputation intact yeah. you cannot be part of the cabal yeah. that's here to destroy me after i built no, my in fact, here to for so long no no no, no 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 but i'm take, being very clear let's take about a break. that and if you don't promise Prof, let's i'm take gonna a, have to say it yeah, here let's in take, the air let's take a break we'll, you'll have a chance i'm gonna say it in air on air if you don't say okay this. we'll take a chance we'll no, take no, a break promise to back off from this all this no, Prof, man. let's take a break now. Detracts. We have to pay the bills. Detracts. Okay, we'll take another break. We'll give the Prof a chance uh, it's to, off. To, to, to the conversation. <laughs> What a heated debate there between, um, you know, the leaving vice chancellor, Professor Mamoche Di Pakeng and uh, JJ Dabane. And honestly, there have been a lot of people with mixed reactions all over Twitter and social media. For me, it's just, it's simple. I am in full support of Mamoche Di Pakeng. How dare he cite uh, things that have been said about her, specifically that people have said that she is intellectually arrogant. If she is, I think she is well deserving to be. I haven't achieved half of what she has achieved intellectually or academically. And already I know that if I were in her shoes, if I were the first black vice chancellor of the University of Cape Town, Africa's most prestigious university, if I was the first black woman to hold a PhD in mathematics, I would 100% be intellectually arrogant. Nobody would tell me anything. Nobody could tell me anything. She deserves to be intellectually arrogant. You know, and for him to cite that, and I think this was nearing the close of the interview, it just begs the question of what his intentions were. You know, we've got this woman that has been forced into an early retirement due to government governance issues by the university. And here you are trying to end off the interview by saying or citing something that you know will upset her. So yes, she was well deserving and had every right to respond by citing things that have been said about him. People have been calling him a journalistic buffoon. People have been calling him a joke. And you could see in the way that he responded how completely uncomfortable he was when she started reading him to filth. He couldn't wait to cut to the break. He could not wait to cut to the break. And I absolutely love it for her. You know, she cited that she wants to leave a legacy. She wants to leave a brand. And she's not going to let anyone say anything that is contrary to how it should be celebrated and how excellent her brand, in my opinion, and in many others is. So thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching this video. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel and the videos. And I will see you in my next upload. Goodbye, lovelies.